India's smallest but most attractive state. It's rare to find an Indian who doesn't want to travel to Goa. In 1543, Vasco da Gama discovered this place. Later, Portuguese colonies were built in Goa. How did Goa become a part of India? Now let's find out. In the end of 15th century, Vasco da Gama set out to India around the Cape of Good Hope. He reached at Calicut and wanted to make a deal with Zamorin. But Zamorin refused to trade with them. At the time of returning Portugal, he was blown back due to monsoon winds and ended up his journey at Anjadip Islands of the coast of Karnataka. Incidentally, they dealt for some lands on the western coasts. Later, Portuguese acquired those lands in which one was swamp. In 1661, that swamp was handed over as dowry to King Charles II when he married Princess Catherine the Braganza of Portugal. That swamp was called Bombay by locals. Portuguese used Goa, Daman, Diu, and Dadra and Nagar Haveli as their colony. They maintained the colony as long as, or in 1955, Jaharlal Nehru started discussions for the Portuguese exit and handover of Goa to India. That time, Portugal was under the directorship of Antonio de Oliveira Salazar. Salazar has no intention to hand over this place to India, rather he claimed Goa was part of metropolitan Portugal, not a colony. To settle this matter, after multiple diplomatic attempts, finally India owned in 1961. To take Goa, the Air Force, the Navy and the Army was mobilized on December 11, 1961. Two days after the attack, Fort Aguada fell, while the Murmagao port was attacked from the sea. At last, in 1961, the 3,500 Portuguese soldiers stationed in Panji surrendered despite the instruction to the contrary from Salazar.
that time, Daman and Diu were also taken from Portuguese. Then Goa became a union territory of India. Later, Goa was eventually found viable enough to be a state and provided statehood on 30th May 1987. It was not until May 1962 the prisoners of war were repatriated. Even today, an inhabitant of Goa, born before the 11th of December 1961, can apply for Portuguese citizenship. However, until 1974, Portugal and India did not resume any diplomatic relationship.